Hi everyone. Welcome to Math with me. I am very happy with the response I am receiving from you people. It is definitely motivating me to do more videos. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please do like, share and subscribe. Thank you for all your support. Today I am discussing about factors, multiples, HCF or GCD or GCF, highest common factor, greatest common divisor or greatest common factor, lowest common multiple that is HKLCM and the divisibility test. It plays the major foundation or uh, basic foundation for algebra and arithmetic. The LCM is used in addition and subtraction of unlike fractions and many more. So it may seem simple, but it plays a vital role in fundamental mathematics. Now let us learn the factors and multiples. Here is an example. I have taken the factors for 28. It is 2 into 2 into 7. I have used the division rule to obtain the factors. 1, 2, 4, 7, 14, 28 are the factors for um, the given number 28. Here it is the multiple of 28. It is essentially the table for 28. Multiples of the numbers are infinite unless it is specified. M multipliers are always greater than or equal to the number itself. Multipliers of the prime number will not be prime. Factors are always less than or equal to the given number. If there are only two factors, that is one in the number itself, then the number is prime number and it is true for the vice versa. It means if, the prior, if there is a prime number, the factors are the number and one. Here is the difference of how to find HCF and LCM for the same set of numbers. For HCF, stop the division process once there is no common factor. For LCM, continue the process and retain the numbers which is not divisible by the chosen number. More examples on HCF and LCM. These are the factors uh, for 22, 24, 26. These are the factors. 2 is the HCF. Here, the LCM is 2 into 2 into 11 into 6 into 30. We will move on to the important properties of HCF and LCM. It is found between two or more integers. LCM found between two or more integers. At least two integers uh, should be given. HCF of 26, 20, 20, uh, 28, 26, 4, 26 is 2. And LCM, I have written. HCF between any two consecutive number is always 1 because there is no common factor. LCM of any two consecutive uh, uh, integers are always multiply those integers. 1 is the least factor for any given number. If there, are, there is a prime number in the given number, then LCM will be a multiple of the prime number. If one of the number is a prime number and no common factor, then HCF is 1. Let's move on to divisibility rule. For 2, the number should be even. 3, the sum of digits divisible by, it must be divisible by 3. 4, last two digits must be divisible by 4. 5, last digit must be 0 or 5. 6, um, should be divisible by 2 and 3. 7, I, I don't follow any rule. 8, last three digits must be divisible by 8. 9, the sum of digits is divisible by 9. Last digit must be 0. For 11, add the alternative digit. Here, an example, 1 plus 1. Then subtract with the uh, sum of middle digits. It is 1 plus 1 minus 2 that is 0. Then the result should be 0 or it must be divisible by 11. Then the given number will be divisible by 11. Thank you all for watching. Keep watching my channel. If you find this useful, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. We'll be back with more interesting stuff next time. Bye.